Hi everyone, so I'm going to show you our um, stroller that we've got for the baby. So this is called the Fill and Head Smart Buggy. Um, this is what it basically looks like. Um, it's got nice big wheels. Um, and they pop off really easily. We've got a little basket down here. Um, that's um, a rain cover. That sort of is on there. So it's got a tiny little basket. Um, when you actually buy this, they don't actually come with the cushy liner, but we bought one just because it looks more comfortable. Um, yeah, the straps adjust really easily. Um, you can just turn it and I'm trying to show you. Um, if you just you just turn it and move it down like that, and it basically moves really, really easily. And everything's wiped clean, which is brilliant, really. Um, you know, if they do have accidents or spill the drinks, um, you know, you can just wipe it down. You don't have to worry about um, sort of taking and ripping all the covers off and washing them. Um, also, this is um, how you adjust sort of um, how long or short you need it for the child. Um, and then it has a five point harness here. So you kind of just snap them out and each one pops in separately, which is I find it's always handy because the car seat ones you have to sort of um, put them together and then pop them in like together, if that makes sense. So yeah, that's um and the cushy line and we paid an extra twenty pounds for that. It's completely worth it though, because it's best it's really makes it look more comfy. Um yeah, and then there's the hood. That moves all the way down, so if it's really sunny, you can sort of pull it to how far you want it. Um, it can be a little game, though, which I find with Alistair. I've used this pusher with Alistair, and um, he kind of pulls it all the way down like this. Just messes about with it, really. So, yeah, so that's the hood. And, yeah, it's a really nice, light stroller. Um, it does face the other way as in the seat faces towards you, but you actually have to buy the um, Verso um, adapters, which we haven't bought yet because obviously we don't really need those yet. So I'm gonna buy those a bit later on. Um, but it, it does recline, but not very much. I'll show you how much it reclines. So that's, it's sat there. And you kind of pop these bits out here, like that. So one that side, and then one that side. Sorry, trying to do it one handedly is a bit difficult. So yeah, that's in the recline position like that. So it's not very reclined and then you can pop them back in and make it more upright. So it doesn't rec really recline in that res that respect, but um like I said, once you get the verso ad adapters to change it to parent facing um, it reclines a lot more, um, and also this seat is from, they say four months, I'd say more like six months plus, so it's definitely not newborn, um, yeah, so that's the first seat. That's the first seat, um, and basically if I want to change it, um, which say if I want to put the carry cot on, I can just press these two buttons, actually sorry, unclip that and then press these two buttons and the seat should just come off like this. So that's the seat off. It's really, really light. Um, and then I can put the, we've got the peanut bassinet here, which looks like this. And it's super light. And also um, I've pulled it out now, so it's basically you can fit a baby in it, but actually flat pack's really slim as well. So you can put it behind a um, like the seat of the car or something. So it makes it really nice and thin, so you don't have to carry a huge carry cup with you. So that's the way that goes, and basically it just snaps in place. Just line them up, and that's it for the carry cup. And you basically use the hood. Um, that way, should I say, for that's better. Yeah, you basically use the hood for the um, the seat. So that's the carry cut on. 
so that's going to come in handy. Um, and it still feels ultra light. It's really easy to steer this for sure. Um, yeah, so that's a carry cut on. So to take it off, you basically just press the red buttons. And that comes off, like so. That's that off. And now you can also put the car seat on. So I've, I got my adapters through today and um, I've been waiting for these for so long. So basically, uh, these are the Maxi Cozy car seat adapters. Um, and you just slip them on like that. You can take this off actually as well, but um, yeah, this just sits on like so. So that's the car seat on. And it's ultra light as well, so it was lighter than the carry cart. So that's the car seat on, which is also handy for me, seeing as I have to, um, obviously, I have to travel um, to like the nearest shop where I live. So to have the baby in the car seat and then to quickly whip out the the frame and stick the car seat on if I'm just popping to the shop for five minutes that's super handy for me so I know I'll be getting a lot of use out of this push chair mainly with the car seat for the first few months anyway um yeah so that's the whole system um I'll show you how it all folds down so to put the push chair down um when it's in sort of this sort of mode with the seat on all you do is, this one's already down actually, they're supposed to be up when you're using it, but you basically just pop these two sides down, if you can see that, it's just a little thing there, and then you press that little button there, and, it, and make sure you put the shade down, and then it literally just folds in like that, so, so that's how it sort of flattens, like this. And it's actually not that heavy. Um, and then basically to get it back up, so you, you put those up. And then to get it back up, you put those down and you push it. And then it's up. So it's really, really simple how to get it out. Yeah, so that's the stroller that we've, you've got for the baby.